For the head gaskets, I'm installing a ARP head head studs. One of my big concerns is, since I'm using such a thick head gasket, this gasket's not going to seal well. So I have a used head gasket that I'm going to put on, and uh, I'm going to see how bad that seal is and what I'm going to do about it. I'll probably just load this up with a gasket maker, like a silicone, see what happens, but see how bad it is. So I didn't realize that my uh, memory card filled up. So what I did was I put in a bead of RTV gasket maker, and then I set this gasket on there, and it's just gently on there while it cures, and that should raise it up enough to make a good seal. With this cured, I'm gonna put on my head gasket and uh, pop the head on and Torque everything down. Just a drink. For a head gasket, I'm using a Cometic uh, 0.14 thick, 0.14 inch thick. Uh, MLS gasket. Now I'm just gonna try to fish the uh, washers and nuts in there and uh, tighten everything down. So that was a nightmare. I definitely wish I put the cams in after those. That sucked. So now I'm just gonna torque everything down to 25 foot-pounds, then 50 foot-pounds, then 75. In the uh, standard pattern. Uh, ARP gives you the pattern. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
lot to do, but uh, I'm gonna temporarily put my valve cover gas valve cover on to uh, keep everything protected. All right, so just test fitting the turbo manifold, I found that I have one, two, three, and then four uh, studs that are too long and they hit the, the manifold. So I'm gonna have to find a way around that. I'll probably just get stock ones or maybe try to find some shorter E90 ones. I'm not too sure.